what's up guys welcome back to another review today we're going to be looking at the full 2016 sheriff's impound lot series so there are six cars in the series sheriff snot rod boost wingo dj and bessie so first we're going to go ahead and take a look at bessie so here is bessie now she is really cool so of course she was rare she was released several years ago and was rare right up until 2016 where she was released now she, and then like right when she was released she just wasn't rare anymore because of course she was she was available in all stores and you know it just of course after everyone got her she, like her rareness just completely faded away so i guess for some people that's bad, but for some people that didn't get her in the first place, that is good. But I guess it's kind of, I guess you can kind of go either way. And there was a plastic version of her released in, I believe in a place that several, several years ago as well. That the Bessie actually did have a little hook on here that you could connect to the cars. But it didn't really work that well, but still, you could do it for a short amount of time. Let's go ahead and get into the... Do a short brief description of Bessie. So here is Bessie, of course, and you know you would expect maybe Bessie to actually be like a living like vehicle, kind of like the cars, of course. But I don't know. I guess not. But so let's just get into her physical features. As you can see here, it says caution. Equipment surface may be hot, and then you can see there's a lot of. There's a lot of dirt and gravel on her, as you can see. It's all over. And then you can see here's a roller. Very cool. Plastic and not removable. Just like the little tanks here as well and the little pipe here. So, and then also this is not removable as well. This is, this is the, I believe the gravel, but that's not removable. And it's plastic. And here it says Bessie. So, I, like, for me, I actually never originally got Bessie, so I'm actually pretty happy that she was released uh, last year. So, now here is Boost. So, of course, we all know what Boost looks like. Now, as you can see here, he's got kind of like the green-looking Zs there. I mean, I always picture them as Zs. And, of course, he has a very nice blue color. And other than that, and then also, you could also picture them as lightning bolts as well, just they're green. That's a pretty cool, chill looking expression there. And it's plastic spoiler, which also is not removable. And then here is Wingo. He's really banged up. Here's his plastic spoiler as well. It's the biggest out of all of them. And I think Wingo might be my favorite out of the four tuners. But honestly, I can't really decide between Boost and Wingo. I'm not really sure. But they both are. One of them is my favorite. But one day I'll probably have to pick. But here are some symbols on him as well, both sides. And he's got a lot of designs on him as well. I think that's really cool. And of course, a nice smiling expression. And of course, here we have Boost with another smiling expression. And then as you can see, there's the red outline on his wheels, which I've always loved. And then you can see his license plate just reads Boost because because his name is enough letters to fit on a license plate. And then here his plastic spoiler and the only one who does not have a spoiler out of the four tuners is snot rod but he is a muscle car so i mean i guess you wouldn't really expect him to have like a huge big spoiler it would look a little bit odd but then also you could see here in light faded looking in a faded looking purple color it says boost that also appears on both sides and now here is snot rod of course and he looks very nice as you can see here here's his plastic engine and it looks very cool it's not removable he has a very angry slash almost like he's up to something looking expression and then here it says snot rod on a black stripe going on both sides as well very cool because the tires and the wheels in the back are much bigger than the ones in the front and last but not least, let's take a look at Sheriff. So Sheriff just has a very, very normal looking expression. And as you can see, he's got the really cool cop look. It says Radiator Springs in the root sign. It says Sheriff underneath. Very, very simple cop car as well. It says Sheriff on the back. And license plate reads 001 with the Radiator Springs cap right in front of it. 
So Sheriff is a really classic cop. That's something I really like. So out of all the police and cops that have been released in the Cars world, I'm pretty sure Sheriff would be my favorite. And also kind of like the grill, which almost resembles a mustache in the Cars world for the men. So I think that's really cool as well. I've always admired that feature on Sheriff. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I did go a little bit more in depth in all the characters as I usually do But anyways, hope you guys did enjoy it and tell me in the comment section below Who is your favorite out of these six awesome cars and we'll see you guys next time for another review Hope you enjoyed Young ones, young ones, but we live for, we die for, we live for forever